Well, hey, Leo, thank you guys so much for coming back to my channel. If you guys are new, hello, I am Yasmin. If you have not already, please like and subscribe. All right, Leo, we're going to go right into your reading. We're going to see what we have for you guys today. This is going to be for Leo. First card that came out is the Four of Wands. Leo, this has something to do with your home, okay? Some of you guys are not liking home. Some of you guys are leaving home. Some of you guys could be in a marriage or in some type of partnership that you guys are not satisfied in. Page of Pentacles. Yeah, you guys want to do something different here. Let's see. I see disappointment. This could be, be for multiple reasons. It doesn't have to be just because of a romantic situation, but I do see disappointment here. Knight of Swords. You guys are going somewhere. You're going somewhere very quickly, okay? <laughs> At the bottom of the deck, Five of Wands. Yes, I see some type of conflict. This is what I was saying earlier. Let me go ahead and get some lotion here for my hands. All right, okay, better. So yeah, there is some type of conflict here with the Five of Wands. Someone is wanting something different. Now, this could be you. This could be your partner. Someone wants something different here. And I feel like you guys are waiting for something differently because there is some, a sense of, uh, you know, unfulfillment, dissatisfaction with that Eight of Cups. Let's go ahead. Let's keep going. I feel like someone has, you know, disappointed you, made promises that they didn't keep is what I'm saying here. Six of Pentacles. You guys are waiting for something stable. I mean, and it, it, it could be with whoever. Like, you may have someone in mind, but you guys are really waiting for something stable here with the judgment. There's someone coming back in here to apologize. You will have decisions to make. You got the Two of Swords. So you guys have heavy decisions to make. Maybe about leaving home, like I said before here with the Eight of Cups. Um, you know, talking to someone on a romantic level it could be more than one person. It could be someone that you guys know that wants to reconcile here with a judgment card. Let's go ahead. Let's keep going. This is going to be for Leo. You guys have some decisions. You will be making a decision because of that judgment, but you will be facing it. A crossroad, so to speak. Okay. King of Swords. And the Nine of Pentacles. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. So, at the bottom of the deck, I have the Strength card. Some of you guys are still kind of focusing on the past. I mean, you guys are trying to move forward. That's true. But you're you're focusing on the past maybe because of what has already happened to you. Um, that type of stuff. I mean, and, and truly, it could be, um, you know, a, a, a family situation or love. I feel like a lot of you guys are trying to let certain things go because it hurts too much. It looks like maybe someone has, has turned cold on you. Now, some of this stuff can happen in the future where someone comes back in and they're like, oh, I miss you. And they still end up ghosting you and, you know, detaching from you, that type of thing. But you, a lot of you guys have already experienced this, some type of resistance when it comes down to commitment. But let's go ahead. Let's get the four of wands here for Leo. Thank you. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Magician, Yeah, you guys are, um, there's something missing from your home. You guys are not happy. Here with the five of pentacles, like I said before, some of you guys, this is your actual home. You know, this is family. This is, you know, something that's missing. It just depends on your story. It could be a lover, a love of your life, or some of you guys don't have enough money when it comes down to your stability. Now that is going to get better. But a lot of you guys are in this lack energy with the five of pentacles. There's just something missing here. And you're waiting for something to change. Let's get this eight of cups here for Leo. Eight of cups for Leo. What came out? Sorry, they're really little. Yeah, eight of pentacles here. There is going to be something new. That's what I'm saying. Um, I feel like with you, you're like, is this going to work when it comes down to your living arrangement? Um, this could be, is this going to work when it comes down to a lover? Like I said, I do see someone coming back in here and with you, you're kind of like, I don't know. I don't know. Let's see. You know, you're, that's why I say you guys have decisions to make. Um, but with you, mostly you're, the, you're trying to be like practical about it. Like, is this going to work? If I talk to this person, is this going to work? If, 
you know, with my family, if someone moved in or if I move out, it's that type of stuff. Let's get the page of Pentacles. This came out. Yeah, you do have someone coming in here. But again, like I said before, and yeah, they're very immature. You know, you for a lot of you, um, this could be someone new. I'm not going to always put this on someone from the past. Some of you guys are attracting very low vibration energy. And it's not saying that you're doing it on purpose. But this person is very much going to detach from you. They're going to come in, woo you, and leave right out. We kind of see it here with that Knight of Swords. I'm seeing coming in and leaving right out. Yeah, and leaving you hanging here watching and waiting and a lot of you guys are waiting for this person to come back in here if you know them or this could be just someone that you guys may have talked to in the past truthfully what it is some of you guys have strong feelings for someone now this could be someone that you have children with but a lot of you guys are waiting for that that stability like i said with that four up wands this person again may have you 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 this person could have made promises to you and you really believed it um, you could have done that, okay? Someone made promises that they cannot keep, okay? Someone was just, someone was moving too fast. Let's get the Six of Pentacles. So you're waiting for a particular person, but there is definitely some type of third party energy. I feel like with you, this has something to do with you. I don't feel like you guys are completely happy with yourself. Um, and this is, could be the reason why you guys are attracting some of the low vibrational energy. Somebody can feel that. Someone knows. Yeah, look at this. There's a lot of, you know, juggling and other people around. And your life feels very unstable because of that. This is also affecting your work as well. Let's get the judgment card. Oh, thank you. Yeah, someone wants to come in and make something right. Your work is going to be good. You guys get a lot of attention, a lot of recognition from your boss when it comes down to your work, okay? Um, this person is going to come in and talk to you, especially if you know this person from the past, but they don't communicate a lot. They're very immature, okay? So that page of wands is letting me know their communication style, and they don't talk a lot. And then we see the king of swords right next to it. Just be prepared for this. Yeah, someone wants another opportunity with you, but I don't see it lasting in the sense that you want to because they're going to run right back out. Let's get this King of Swords. Thank you. Yeah, look at, look at what came out. King of Swords and leaving you still wanting more, still, you know, feeling empty here with the Five of Pentacles. Whoever you're dealing with is a very lost soul, okay? Um, they have lessons that they have to learn here with the temperance. You do too. But it's like until this person grows and until you get to the place where you have to be, there's going to be some issues. And that's why I said, even when it comes down to you attracting certain attention, you're going to be attracting this attention just because there are some things that I feel like you got to work on yourself as well. Let's get this nine of pentacles. So I do see you focusing on yourself in the future. That's what I'm saying. Your money is going to be amazing. Very hard worker here, Leo. Your money is going to be good, especially if you've been having problems with your finances. It's going to get better. Um, some of you guys could be waiting on a job to call. And I do see here because of the, the King of Pentacles that something is going to pull through for you. Please control how you're feeling emotionally and energetically because I feel like there's a lot that's being pulled from you here, Leo. That's what I'm saying. Let's go ahead. Let me see what else I can grab. Just give me a second. I'm just going to pull some cards here. I'm not going to necessarily clarify anything. Let's get some messages here for Leo. Let me see what else is going on. I have the king and queen of pentacles. Wow. So eventually you are going to look at this. So eventually you are going to be, you know, meet someone. Um, you're going to meet your match is what I'm saying. Some of you guys could be dealing with an earth sign. And I really do feel like there is going, there is someone who may love you, but they're just immature. Okay. I'm just going to tell you um, as far as expressing it. Okay. This is secret love, but I do see love coming in, in your energy. There is somebody who loves you, who isn't saying anything here with the seven of wands. This is, you know, basically teaching you to create boundaries because your heart has been broken too many times here with the three of swords, too much disappointment, things not moving far enough, you know, uh, things not moving the way you want it to move, causing you so much unhappiness. And you may have been waiting very patiently for a particular person. Um, or just waiting in general for love to come in your life. And that has caused a lot of unhappiness because it hasn't come. But I do feel like it will. There will be love coming in and there's going to be someone who's going to invest in you is what I'm saying. Let's go ahead. Let's get one more here for Leo. 
But yeah, I'm seeing interference like crazy here. Someone loves attention. Whoever you're dealing with loves attention from other people. So they, they could have money, okay? They're very manipulative. So like I said before, you guys will have decisions to make here with the Two of Swords. Some of you guys are going to have more than one partner to choose from. But there is going to be an ending completely, you know, letting someone go. There's a lot of change. And we saw the Tempest card, which means that the universe is trying to get you to change. But here with the, the strength, why are you resisting? Okay. Don't resist change because the universe has something better for you. Remember, staying in this uh, this unfulfillment energy is not going to be, you, you're not going to be able to be here forever. It's going to just, you know, completely kill your soul. Um, dealing with people who are not on your level. So I do see eventually you're going to be walking away from people. You're going to heal. Okay. No more nonsense is what I'm saying. But this is what I have for you, Leo. Thank you guys so much for coming back to my channel. And again, if you guys are new, please like and subscribe, hit that notification bell, and I'll see you guys back here again soon. Bye guys.